Do you know how to work with exponential properties involving products? Let's take a look at an example. x squared times x to the third. Now, when I multiply these two terms together, I'm going to add the exponents. So I have x, because the x is the same, squared plus cubed equals x to the fifth. This is my final answer. Let's look at another one. Let's say I have 3a squared times 4a to the fourth. I'm going to work with this one a little differently. First I'm going to multiply the coefficients. 3 times 4 which gives me 12. Then I have a squared plus the fourth equals 12a to the sixth. This is my answer. Let's look at one more like that. Let's say I have 4y times 6y squared. Again, I'm going to multiply 4 times 6, which gives me 24. And this y over here, it has a 1 there. You may not see it, but it's still y to the first. So I'm going to have y 1 plus 2, which equals 24y cubed. This is my answer here. What about here? Now you have x squared to the sixth power. This is like saying I have x squared times 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 x squared. Now if I was going to multiply this out like I did the ones on the other screen, I would add all these exponents. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. And I would get x to the 12th. But there's a shortcut. Look at this again. x squared to the 6th power. When I have something that looks like this, I can take x and multiply the two exponents. And I would still get x to the 12th. Here's a cubed to the 5th power. Again, I could write a cubed out five times, but instead I'm going to use my shortcut and multiply 3 times 5, and my answer is a to the 15th power. Sometimes you can also have a situation that looks like this, where you'll have a to the 9th times a cubed and all of that quantity is squared. Now I'm going to work with this inside the parentheses first. So I have a to the ninth times a to the third, so I'm going to add these exponents. And I have a 9 plus 3, I'm going to keep the squared there, I haven't dealt with that yet, equals a to the twelfth squared. Now, I could write a to the twelfth two times, or I can simply take a and multiply twelve times two, and my final answer is a to the twenty-fourth power.